Hey guys, this is Alex Delaney, Ryuka 1993. Oh, that's right. Doing a deck profile for my lit. <laughs> hey, Sorry. shut your hole. You, Start over again. <laughs> shut your whole face. I'm gonna cry. Keep it as a blooper. <laughs> <laughs> a blooper. I I was By the way, I think it's still recording. Second place to get the wait. I'm not. No. No. Oh, right. oh yeah. No. Hi guys. I'm talking about this. <laughs> you should do that. By the way, it's still recording. Oh yeah. You can oh. Edit. Okay. Edit Sweet. Thing. Okay. Yeah. Anyway. Alex Delaney, Ryuka 1993. This is my Link Joker deck profile. Just took this to Kansas City, placed 8th out of 55. And uh, I'd just gotten this deck the day before, so not even mad. You're welcome. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You want to do this? But yeah, this is my starter, Dusttail Unicorn. One of each. Yeah, He's too good. That's all I can say. He is the best starter that you can run with right now for Link Joker. Counterblast break. one, lock Work a card, Saturday, yeah, break right into triangle lock. <laughs> Team Work Upon Saturday. GG. <laughs> anyway, so, I am running Nebula Lord. Yeah, it's gonna be my four. His effect is Counterblast two, lock a back row unit, and at limit break, he gets plus three to every Link Joker in the front row, which can make for some pretty ridiculous numbers. Break right into that, pop off Unicorn, He's swinging for 30 by himself for that turn. Ridiculous. Then of course, running the four break ride, infinite zero dragon. His skill is you ride a grade three over him and you lock a front row rear guard and a back row rear guard. And of course, when he attacks, he gets plus two, so hits for 13. Then we've got Radon, the standard 12K attacker for Link Joker or Star Vader specifically. Then a card I really underestimated until I played it. Uh. Mobius Breath Dragon. You're so welcome. It's a rare from a trial deck. Yes, thank you, Tom and Kyle. <laughs> yeah, this guy's effect is when he's on Vanguard and he hits, you lock an opponent's rear guard, front row, back row, doesn't matter. It makes for such good pressure on grade two. Hey, I want to tell you, on, it, when you're grade locked on that, tell me how sad you are. Not even. Not uh, nope. Right. Nope. Actually, Not one even. game I grade locked myself just so I could get it off again. <laughs> then we've got one of the MVPs of the deck, <laughs> Furious Claw Starvatum Neobium. This guy's skill. Let's get that perfect card out of there. It's about this guy, not those. Anyway, this guy's skill. Whenever he's on the field and an opponent's rear guard is locked, gets plus two thousand. Means if he's in the front row and you have break ride. He gets plus, let's see, 7,000 before you pop off any other effects, which is ridiculous. Then you've got your standard four perfect guards, Barrier Star Vader, Vader Prometheum. Staple in pretty much every deck in this format because numbers are getting stupid high. You've got your 10k attackers, Mana Shot Star Vader Neon. He's just solid. Good for a grade one rush, or if you're short on rear guards. Really good utility. We've got one of the other MVP cards of the deck. Demon Claw Star Vader Lanthanum. He's got the same effect as, ne as Neobium. Plus two when he's on the field. Whenever a rear guard is locked, it's at stupid numbers. I hit 40s and 50s with these guys on the field. Just retarded. Then I'm running two Strafing Star Vader Ruthenium. Basically, this guy is the special booster for Nebula Lord. When he boosts a Nebula Lord Vanguard or Rear Guard, you Soul Blast one card and he becomes an 11k booster. On Rear Guard, that makes him 22. Or if you got Rear Guards locked, Bear. Then Trigger Lineup, I am running. <laughs> It's okay, bro. It's okay. Yeah. Running four Star Vader Meteor Liger. That's just, you know, crit trigger and it looks badass. We've got three Star Vader Weiss Soul Dot. So, seven crit. <coughs> then, running five draw triggers, four Nebula Captor, and one Scouting Ferris. Now, a lot of people are running 8 crit, 4 draw. I'm running the extra draw just because I like hand. That's really all I can say. What guy doesn't like a little hand? 
<laughs> aye, aye. And then, of course, you know, four heels, pretty standard. That was a good place.